Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Dr. Shivam's Academy. If you're walking into this little space for the first time, then I'm Dr. Shivam and I make videos on everything. So before I begin the video, let me remind you that if you have not subscribed my channel, then make sure you do that. And also hit the bell icon so that you get all the notifications for my upcoming videos. As you've already seen in the title of the video, coronavirus. So yeah, today I'll be talking about that pandemic disease, coronavirus infection. Be day or night, everyone's living in the fear of being affected from coronavirus, especially during the second wave of coronavirus, which has previously caused millions of deaths across the globe. Yes, the virus is back again. This time it is with more energy, more tactics and camouflage. What is the reason for the increase in the number of cases throughout the globe? What could be the reason? The answer is quite simple. It is because of the irresponsible behavior of the humans and the negligence, especially during public gatherings. People still don't maintain social distance. Apart from this, I still see people not wearing masks when they go outside. Compared to the COVID-19 first wave, the symptoms in second wave are quite different. We don't see fever, we don't see cough in the patients. The patients mostly complains of joint pains and weakness. Apart from this, the patient is also complaining of loss of appetite and COVID pneumonia, which is a quite common symptom that each and every patient suffering from COVID. Of course, the mortality rate in these patients are quite higher. It takes very less time to get to the extreme. Sometimes you don't even see any symptoms. I'll make a separate video on the differences between the first wave and second wave of coronavirus. What symptoms which you saw in the first wave, is it still the same in the second wave or not? And what new symptoms you can say in the second wave? I'll be making a new video on that. Let me tell you a fact about coronavirus. It's not a new virus. It is not a virus which was invented recently. That is in 2019. No, not at all. Coronavirus, this first outbreak of coronavirus was seen in 2003. Yes, you heard me right, in 2003. This was an outbreak in China. After this, we also had a second outbreak of coronavirus in 2012. And then the third outbreak was in 2015. And then the fourth outbreak was in 2019, which is now considered a pandemic disease. This coronavirus has already made four attacks on our community. This outbreak of coronavirus in 2003 was named as SARS, Severe Acute Respiratory Syndrome. This was the first version of coronavirus. Similarly, the 2012 and 15 outbreak was also the first version of coronavirus. The spread of this first version of coronavirus was from bat. And from bat, it spread to the cats and from cats to the humans. Yes, the mortality rate was still 10%. For example, in every 10% one was dead. So the mortality was still high, but this didn't go for a long time. This recovered within an year. Coronavirus, which was seen in 2019, was completely different from the first version of coronavirus. And that's why it was named as novel coronavirus. Apart from this, it was also called SARS-CoV-2 which is severe acute respiratory syndrome coronavirus 2 the second version of coronavirus let's talk about the second version of coronavirus which was seen in 2019 and was considered a pandemic i think it's better we start from the very beginning where it started what is this coronavirus what is covid 19 where did this virus come from so guys Basically, this virus was first detected in China, in a city called Wuhan. From there, this virus spread to every part of the world and mainly affected countries like Italy, USA, India and China. There were millions of deaths occurred due to this virus. This coronavirus disease is also called as COVID-19. CO stands for Corona, VI stands for Virus, D stands for disease and 19 is the stream, the year in which it was detected. This is simple confusion that most of the people have is what is the difference between coronavirus and COVID-19? 
it is as same as the difference between HIV and AIDS. HIV is a virus and AIDS is a disease. Similarly, coronavirus is a virus and COVID-19 is a disease. This virus mainly affects the lungs. You cannot breathe and that's why the COVID pneumonia, which is the common symptom that each and every corona patient has. So let's talk about how this coronavirus spreads from one person to another person. It's simple. It's through the air. The aerosols that are present in the air spreads the virus from one person to another person. You sneeze, the person gets it. A person standing anywhere near to you, he gets it. Uh, other than that, you sneeze, you shake hand with the person next to you or any of your colleagues, then this virus is spread to him. This is how the virus spreads. To know more about coronavirus, its symptoms, what happens when the virus spreads from one person to other person, how it affects in the person's body, what are the necessary precautionary methods that you need to take and what is the treatment for coronavirus. Apart from this, I'll also clear out certain myth that is spread about coronavirus and also talk about since reality. Since I've been working as a COVID frontline warrior, I believe that I can clear out certain myths that has been spread across the globe by few of the rumors. So guys, stay tuned with my channel. I'll be coming up with more videos on coronavirus. Since it's a vast topic and cannot be covered in a video, single video, which I would say a video of about 10, 20 or 30 minutes. So people would obviously lose their interest and that's why I decided to make a series on this topic of coronavirus and I'll be coming up with the next video very soon. So please do watch all the videos in this series of coronavirus because it's going to be very effective and also share among your friends and family members. Till then, take care guys, stay safe. Take care of your family members and yourself. Catch you later. And if you have not subscribed my channel, then do subscribe my channel, Dr. Shivam's Academy. And hit the bell icon so that you can get all the notifications for my upcoming videos. Thank you.